guys yo 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 what's up welcome back to shop and more with kimberly and santos yeah you so in today's video we're gonna be sharing with you guys our favorite um layering combos now these are the combos that we've uh, come up with ourselves and we've been loving and we want to share it with you guys so maybe you guys can try it out and you know i don't mind yeah <laughs> yeah he's getting into all the layering combos <laughs> but yes uh we hope you guys enjoy if you do give it a thumbs up consider subscribing if you haven't done so already and for all our returning subscribers thank you so much for always clicking on and showing your continued love and support <laughs> so yes let's go ahead and get started because we have a few cents we want to talk about all right you want to go first okay first cent of course, if y'all know me, y'all know <laughs> Fresh Amalfi Lemon. Yes, dude. <laughs> I use this thing for so many combos. I've used it for fresh uh, fruity sherbet scoop. I used it with uh, sweetheart cherry. I mean, I was going to use it with uh, strawberry pound cake. <laughs> what the hell? I mean, some more citrus. I mean, you name it, this thing goes with all kinds of scents. But it's more of like the fruity, sweet, uh, gourmand scents that I tend to use this scent with. Mm -hmm. um, I was thinking of trying it with more musky scent. Uh, I was thinking of trying it with like, uh, what do you call that? The bamboo and surf? Yeah. I was thinking of trying I, it with that. I think that'll work. Like a, like a green. Yeah. With it, I know? think that'll work. So I want to try that next. I want to try some different combos. But yeah, I mean, this thing goes with all kinds of scents. Yes. So this is one of my favorites. <laughs> so if, if y'all want to see a part two from us, let us know down in the comments. Yeah, because we got a lot of them that we, or well, I do. I have a lot. I do a lot of combos. I love doing combos. Yeah. I love layering. I'm starting so. to get into it. It's been a couple months now. So yeah. <laughs> <laughs> so yeah. Fresh Amalfi Lemon. This one has lemon leaves, chilled spearmint, and cedarwood citrus. <laughs> oh, yeah. I actually used a shower gel today. Did you? <laughs> yes. It's All right. Really good. <laughs> See, stuff good. Mm -hmm. Oh, yeah. I love this one. The spearmint's not too strong, but you do get a hint of the spearmint. The lemon leaves are very strong. Oh, That's yeah. what you get hit with in the beginning. And then you have the uh, cedarwood citrus. I love that it's not overpowering, but it's still present. Yeah. The cedarwood citrus. Mm -hmm. You know, so, yeah. Love this. Fresh Amalfi Lemon. So what did you pair it with? This one I paired with uh, Fruity Sherbet Scoop. Of course. <laughs> you love that combo. Yeah, I love this combo. I do it all the time. I've done it two days in a row. I mean... I love this one. This one has rainbow sherbet, zesty orange, and sun-kissed strawberry. Did you also wear the body cream to this one? Yes. I also wore the body cream. I use both body creams, the Fresh Amalfi Lemon and the Fruity Sherbet Scoop. Mm. I put, first I put on the, the lemon, and then I put the Sherbet Scoop on top. Mm. But yeah, this stuff, oh, yeah. Oof. These fruity gourmand soup, soups. <laughs> Scents. <laughs> it's a soup now. <laughs> I'll make a soup out of it. <laughs> All right. <laughs> no, they go really well together, though. This is one of my favorite combinations. Fruity Chabay Scoop. Not soup. <laughs> yeah. So, what's yours? What's your first one? All right. This is actually my scent of the day. And, um, this combo right here, I actually used the shower gel to the Fresh Amalfi Lemon. So I I did the shower gel, and then when I got out, I layered it. Uh, I went on top with Vanilla Bean Noel Body Butter. And this one has notes of fresh vanilla bean, warm caramel, sugar cookies, whipped cream, and snow kiss musk. Yeah. Smells like a yummy gourmand sugar cookie with caramel. So good. And then on top of that, I went in with orange vanilla twist. And oh yeah. my God, I was smelling scrumptious, guys. <laughs> so, so good. This combo is fire. 
And this one has notes of juicy orange, summer sorbet, and vanilla creme. Creme. So the reason why I paired the two is because this one has vanilla in it and I wanted to bring out the vanilla more in this one. So that's why I paired it with the vanilla bean well and man. Mm -hmm. Thank me later if you guys try this combo. <laughs> so good. Absolutely love it. And this one smells like an legit, legit creamsicle. Ugh. Creamsicle. I always say creamsicle. Yeah. Ugh, yeah. Yeah, see, every time I smell that one, it makes me want to go eat one. They don't yeah. have it at Wendy's no, anymore. I had no more. That, that, um... <laughs> they have the berry one now, <laughs> which is good. We tried it. It's really good. It's not too sweet. Yeah. Yeah, I do that. The berry one is pretty good. Yeah. But that one, my dreams to go ice cream. That one was like the best one, hands yeah. down. For real. It really mm -hmm. was. They should have kept it on the menu for... All times. Yeah, right? Yeah. But yeah, try this combo uh, guys out. It's so good. Next. <clears throat> the next combo I used was Sweetheart Cherry. See, I got my little mini right here. This one's going to go pretty quick. <laughs> I've been using the heck out of it. I could have sworn you grabbed a full size during SAS, but I guess it was just the cream. I think I just grabbed the cream and the shower gel. Yeah. Yeah. So this one I pair with, you guessed it, Fruity Sherbet Scoop. <laughs> Already. <laughs> I'm loving this one as well. But these combos, this one right here, this, I think it brings out the cherry more. And then this one, you get more of the, the rainbow sherbet. Because it, it just smells so scrumptious together. Like, I don't know, it's, it makes you want to eat it up. Is this the combo you wore today? Yes. Okay, when he he when he wore it and it, it projected off him like big time, I thought he was wearing the lavender and vanilla one that just came out and mm -hmm. the you know the neutrals collection. That's what it smelled like to me. I thought it was the lavender one. And see, and I was just mixing these two together. And what I did was I sprayed myself like crazy with both of them. And uh I put the cream in my on my head and I used the sweetheart cherry cream and I used the Fruity Sherbet cream, and then I sprayed it. I sprayed myself like that. Should have brought out the creams. Didn't yeah, I didn't bring them out because I didn't want to grab everything. Yeah. <laughs> and that's what I, was like. I could just tell you guys what I did. But yeah, I used the creams and I used the sprays for each one. So, it, I mean, it's pretty intense and it yeah. gives it like a, a real, like a, like a snack, like, <laughs> like for real. It's more like vanilla, like the lavender. It's just all good. Everything's just good about it. It was good all the way around, period. It definitely yeah. was. It was smelling so good. Sweet. Yep. Sweetheart. Shelly. Fruity Chibay Scoop. Great combo. Try it out, guys. Yep. All right. So I've talked about this combo a few times in our videos, but I want to share it because I'm loving it. So... I like to put on the bourbon, strawberry, and vanilla body cream. And I mix it with one of my faves, Pink Obsessed. <laughs> so Pink Obsessed is a dupe uh, for uh, Valentino Donna Born Aroma. Uh, it's the high-end perfume. Uh, but this one has notes of blushing jasmine, cashmere praline, and vanilla bourbon. And I'm bourbon... Praline. Right. Bourbon, strawberry and vanilla has notes of bourbon, vanilla, garden, strawberry, apricot, nectar, pink, jasmine and white oak. And um, since this one has bourbon and vanilla and this one has bourbon and vanilla, I think they pair beautifully together. That's why I chose the two. And um, this one is real perfumey. So it just like and not only that, this one kind of has like a sweetness. So. It just makes it more sweeter and more perfumier because this one's perfumey too. So I think these two are a great combo. It's so girly and perfumey and sweet. And yeah, I hope we get more of the Pink Obsessed. I would love to have the body cream and some more sprays of this one because I am absolutely obsessed. <laughs> no pun intended. <laughs> But yeah, this one is a fire combo, ladies. So give it a try. So good. All right. 
Next, I have Orange Vanilla Twist and Sun Wash Citrus. <laughs> Y'all know me. I love my somewhat citrus. I love my citrusy scents. Mm -hmm. And I, I love this one as well. So pairing these two together is a no-brainer for me. Oh, yeah. Yeah, this one has uh, the juicy orange summer sherbet vanilla creme and sugar lemons mandarin and agave nectar. This one's not around anymore. I don't think so, right? No, it's not. I don't have this one around anymore, so... Uh, unless you have it already, you're not going to be able to pair it, but, uh, this one was a great one. I use this with all kinds of scents as well. Yeah. Uh, I love this one together. So I, I like to switch them up. I like to switch them up, put Fruity Sherbet Scoop with this one or Sweetheart Cherry with this one. And, you know, I, I like to switch them up, but this combo right here was great as well. This one's going to smell so good on me tomorrow when I do this one. <laughs> Yeah, uh, since you're going to be layering it with the, the lotion, it'll sweeten this one up. Yeah. It'll sweeten it up. Now I'm going to smell like another snack. <laughs> Different kind of snack. <laughs> like an orange drinksicle. Yeah. <laughs> All right, so the next layering combo is um, I wore the Wild Madagascar Vanilla. This is a re-release from SAS. And then I paired it with Pink Obsess, of course. <laughs> And uh, we actually did a review slash comparison on these two. In my opinion, I get the DNA from this one in this one. That's what I'm picking up. Mm. So that's why I chose the two together because it kind of has the same DNA to Arno's because he smells it too. Yeah. So yeah, it was smelling so good, sweet and perfumey and very uh, flirty and... It's just real perfumey and it, it projects and it's so good. Uh, it's such a great combo. And yeah, I should have grabbed more of this one because I am loving it. It's so good. It's not like a gourmand. It's more of a grown up perfumey vanilla in my opinion. And she's fire. So yeah, these two are so, so good. Oh, this one, I forgot to tell you the notes. This one has notes of Wild Mad Madagascar Accord, African Pear, and Wild Jasmine. And Pink Obsessed has Blushing Jasmine, uh, Cashmere Praline, and Vanilla Bourbon. So, yeah. Nice. So good. All right. Next, I have Steel. Steel here. Uh, this was an online exclusive. This one has Cool Bergamot, Crushed Woods, and Tonka Bean. Yeah, I love layering steel with Chanel Blue. This one here is such a great combo. Mm -hmm. Oh, I love this combo. It's too musky, too musky scents. Yeah. You know, but this one's uh, like a, a fresh and this one's cool. I think this one has like a bergamot or a citrus. No, I think that's what it says. I think that's what it is. Mm -hmm. I think the citrus is what <laughs> gives me that nice. I think I lo I just love citrus scents. That's why you bought it because yeah. you you smelled the citrus. I'm scent. attracted <laughs> to citrus, yeah. Mm -hmm. So putting these two together is such a great idea for me, and it always works so well. I can put this cream all over me, and then I spray myself down with this. Yeah, yeah, really good stuff. Mm -hmm. I don't think I have the keynotes to this one, but mm -mm. Uh, yeah, great stuff here, guys. If you can get your hands on it. That'll be a good one to put. Put on for the day. Yeah. You'll be every lasting all day long. Yeah, and it lasts. It projects too. It's got quite a scent bubble. Oh, yeah, definitely. Yeah. All right. So, something nice, aquatic, and summery. Let's go ahead and switch it up a little bit. So, I wore Gingham Unstoppable. This one has notes of fresh neroli, sparkling water, and clean musk. I went ahead and applied this one first because you always need a base before you put on your mist or your uh, perfume. And then I went on top with a fresh getaway. This is an older scent back in, what was it? 21. Uh, it's hard to see. Yeah, 21. Um, this one has notes of bright yuzu citrus and fresh ocean air. And... On top of that, I went in with Endless Sea, and man, I was smelling so fresh, so like right out the shower type of scent, very aquatic and perfumey, and uh, 
you just bring out when I wore it with the cream, you bring out um, the citrus kind of like in both of them. She's fresh, fresh, exciting. <laughs> <laughs> but yeah, this is a bomb layering combo. And yeah, I absolutely love it. So love it. All right. Next, I have Dark Amber and Oud. This one here, um, I don't know if they're going to come out with this one again. Mm, I hope uh, they do. The fall, because I, uh, I think I saw that they might come out with it again. Uh, this one has a smooth, rich fragrance inspired by ambery oud wood after a fresh rain. Now this one, I paired it with marble, Mediterranean waters, cliffside geranium, and amber wood. So you only did the two body creams? Yes, because well, I did the two body creams and I did the cologne. The cologne, so the which cologne one? spray for the dark amber and oud. Oh, okay. So. I put these two creams on, then I put the cologne spray on of the dark amber and oud. So that was a great combo. Uh, I think you thought I was wearing something else, but this is like a high end type scent. Yeah. It, it's like a manly, musky, high end type. Yeah, because that oud smells very expensive. Yes. And which it really is. Yes. And then mixed with this amber wood and the geraniums. Oh man, it was such a great combo. I love the way it smells. I can't wait to do it again. This is a great one right here. Smell nice and woodsy and oh, cologne. Yeah. High <laughs> end, like you can go into the office or something like that. Right? Yeah. Very sophisticated and yep. put together. Exactly. <laughs> Your boss, man. Boss. <laughs> All right. So next combo is somebody suggested it in our um in our comments so i went ahead and tried it out so i wore sweetheart cherry and the body cream this one has notes of wild cherry crushed pistachio and wet vanilla and i paired it with firecracker pop huh. yep this is the i think this is the very first bottle that came out for firecracker pop correct me if i'm wrong uh this one is 2022 version this one has notes of red cherry, fresh citrus, and juicy berry. And when I pair the two together, um, it brings out the cherry more and sweetheart cherry. And it just made it so juicy and gourmand and fresh and juicy. Uh, I absolutely love firecracker pop, especially for summertime. Yeah, it brings out the cherry so much. Hmm. and the cream but yeah if you have this combo i suggest trying it out so so good yeah i might have to do that with myself mm -hmm. it's awesome all right next i want to try this combo lavender and vibrant you haven't tried it yet i haven't tried it yet oh, no. but this is something that i want to use and i'm i have a feeling i'm gonna use it again and again and again <laughs> Because I, I tried it on my hand. I sprayed both of them on my hand, and it's going to smell good. Well, you kind of did try it then, if you sprayed it on your hand. Yeah, I did, but I haven't I haven't worn it for the day. Yeah. But this is a combo that I know I'm going to love. It has lavender, jasmine, and vanilla. So this is going to be something that I use, I already know, pretty often. It's like the other ones, uh, Fruity Chabay and the Citrus. It's, yeah, once yeah. I get started... Ain't no stopping. And with the <laughs> vibrant, yeah, I love me some vibrant. Yeah, and I gave him the perfume because I yeah. had an extra one. Yeah, so they don't mind. <laughs> and not only that, I have the full size perfume. So I was like, you know what? Go ahead and you can have it, baby. Get you some of that. <laughs> yeah, you know I love that. Love me some vibrant. Oh, yeah, definitely. All right, so the next combo is. I think I talked about it the other day in one of our videos. I wore Tahiti Island Dream. This one has notes of fresh coconut water, sparkling mandarin, kiwi blossom, lush frangipani, and Tahitian vanilla musk. And I went on top with uh, Thailand kiwi, sweet kiwi, and star fruit. Nice. Man, this scent is very candy-like and sweet and kind of fresh. 
And this one is tropical and perfumey and a little exotic and fruity. So pairing the two together, it just brings out more of the fruitiness in this one. And it's very long lasting and it projects and it almost kind of gives it like a candy, uh, perfumey, exotic vibe. But yeah, this one was a loud scent. It lasted all day long. It's so good together. I highly recommend it. Huh. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Mm. That's the one. Yeah, I wanted a full size in the sweet kiwi and star fruit, but we never got around to grabbing it. If we see it in store this weekend, so maybe we, we should grab it. it. <laughs> yeah. So yeah, cause I'm gonna want to use it too. Mm-hmm. So good. Next we have Oh, let me do this one first. I used lavender with stone. Oh wow, what the Yeah. I was huh. I was like, you know what? This has lavender. Oh, that's why okay. Stone has the alpine water, cool lavender, and sandalwood. There you go. And this one has lavender, jasmine, and vanilla. Mm -hmm. that so makes sense. putting these together, man. It smells so good. It was like a musky, but yet a uh, slight hint of feminism from this one. From the lavender from the and jasmine. lavender and jasmine, you know. And vanilla. But this one kind of overpowered it a little bit. So you could barely smell this one, but it still smelled really good together. Huh, that's a so, good combo. Yeah, the mm -hmm. musk of this one kind of overpowered this one. But man, that sandalwood in this one. Yeah. It was so good. It's it, This kind of, they complemented each other very well. Hmm. So, it's like for a nice day out. Yeah. You know? And it had a great scent bubble, and I smelled it the whole day and the next day. So, I wore it like two, three times, but I can't wait to do it. I think that's the one I wore that day that I forgot what day I wore. Oh, uh, Fragrance Friday of last week? Yes, and I couldn't remember what day I wore. Yeah, because... What I wore. I don't remember you wearing that combo. I guess maybe it was that day, like you were saying. I think that saying. was the day because I had for, totally forgot about it. And then I was looking at it earlier and I was like, hey, I like this combo when I wore it. And I was like, shoot. And I you think didn't, that was it. And you didn't tell me uh, to, so I could put it in the notes. Yeah, so. I think you were in the kitchen or something like that. And I yeah. was over here in the room putting it on. Oh, okay. Yeah. So that's, that's what happened. <laughs> But all right, the next layering combo, man, I am loving some cherry this summer. So I wore a Sweetheart Cherry, and I'm going to go ahead and read the notes again. Wild Cherry, Crushed Pistachio, and Wet Vanilla. And I paired it with Sunset Glow. Oh, man, this is oh, so good. Sunset Glow has notes of fresh coconut, sparkling cherry seltzer, dreamy moonflower, and caramelized vanilla. And man, I am speechless with this scent. It just brings out the cherry more in this one, along with the um, like the pistachio caramelized vanilla that this one has. It's and pistachio? Uh, no, but it has a caramelized vanilla. So I mean, so it mixes with it. Yeah, it complements sweet, each other. Sweet. Mm hmm. So yeah, I absolutely love this combo. It's so good and gourmand and perfumey. Oh, yeah. Yeah, that's mm. one of the ones that's uh, tolerable to me that has coconut in it. Yeah, because you don't pick too much. Too much. It's more of the coconut water, I think, right? Uh, I think it's uh, the fresh coconut. So it's like in the background. Yeah. Yeah. But yeah, if y'all tried out this combo, combo, let me know down in the comments. I would love to know your thoughts. Yeah. I love it. It's so good. And the last combo I have is Oasis mixed with Bamboo Surf. Hmm. Yeah, two green scents. This uh, The Oasis has coconut water. <laughs> There's your coconut. Seaside lavender and wild palm. So the lavender and the coconut water, the coconut water is not like super noticeable because I don't really like coconut too much. But mixed with this one, this one has a light as air mist, oh wait, a watery fresh fragrance inspired by boardwalk greenery and salty air beaches. So they both have that greenery aquatic. Yes. 
colony vibes. So that's why I was liking it. I was like, you know what? Let me try them out. They both have like a green scent to them. And boy, they worked great. Yeah, it sounds like they worked great by the yeah. notes. But this one, I haven't worn in a long time. I haven't worn this combo in like forever. Yeah. It's been a while. When I first got this one, that's when I had tried it. Oh, wow. You should wear it tomorrow. Remember I was telling you a long time ago when I first got this one, I was like, hey, I've been pairing them with something else. It was Oasis. Oh, ah, okay. With, so. huh. Yeah, it's been a while, but I'm going to use this again. Now that it's summertime again, mm -hmm. I'm going to put this one on again. Yeah, so you should. I got to leave these out. <laughs> Yeah, put them front and center there so yeah. you don't forget. All right, so my last combo. Um, I know this scent right here is not really for, like, the summertime and stuff like that because it's so hot. and It's for any time. This scent <laughs> is, like, real, you know, out there and thick. and But sometimes I crave gourmands for the summertime. So mm. when I do, I like to wear... Uh, this right here. I wore Christmas cookies. <laughs> this one has notes of creamy cookie dough, almond biscotti, and caramel woods, along with confetti cake pop. This one has, it doesn't have the notes on the back. This is the OG scent. But if I can remember correctly, it has vanilla cake batter, rainbow sprinkles, and... <laughs> creamy cake frosting i think i maybe you should put it in the thing yeah i'm gonna put it on the screen <laughs> but man layering these two together oh my word so good so gourmand and edible and oh they need to bring confetti cake pop back and this version right here this one was fire yeah, because the re-release was watered down and it wasn't as strong as this one right here. Mmm. Okay. Yeah, very cakey and sweet and edible and gourmand. And the Christmas cookies has that almond biscotti note that I absolutely love. It's very cookie Too and almondy for me. Almondy, and I just think these two complement each other. This smells like straight up some, like some cookies, like some Christmas cookies <laughs> with some frosting on top. <laughs> it's so good, guys. So, yeah, I had to um, let y'all know about this combo right here because uh, fall and winter is coming up and it's the perfect time to pull this one out. So, yeah, so good. <laughs> I'm ready for it. Mm-hmm. But yeah, that is it for our layering combos. Let let us know down in the comments what y'all thought. We would what y'all thought about the video. We would love to know. What is y'all's favorite layering combo? Yes. Let us know down below as well. Yeah. So maybe if we have some of the scents, we can try it out and give y'all some feedback on it. Yeah. <laughs> but yeah. Until next time, guys. Y'all have a great day or night, and we'll talk to y'all real, real soon. Bye. Love y'all. Yeah, Don't forget to be nice. Bye. Thank you.